Hello people, I am the Comic Book Gamer, and this is the Ireland part of my vlog. So yeah, I know it sounds like I'm talking into a Pringles can, but bear with me, that's just the way my mic is for this part. Anyways, as what you're seeing on screen is the Jedi Archives. This is in Ireland, well in Dublin, uh, at some like college, and we when I first came in here, I looked at my sister, I was like, this looks just like the Jedi Archives, this is awesome from, you know, uh, Episode 2, Attack of the Clones, where, like, Obi-Wan went and researched about Master Sifo-Dyas and all that. And then when we stepped in there, we saw that they actually had a comic for, um, Episode 2 in there. It's like, this place looked familiar. George Lucas used it as inspiration for, you know, Episode 2 for the Jedi Archive. So, yeah, I thought that was cool, and it was definitely one of the highlights of being in Dublin. I thought I'd tell you guys, because the mic quality and everything in the actual video was terrible. So, I'm doing a voiceover now, but, yeah, this is a little bit better. So, yeah. Uh, on to the next part of the vlog, I guess. Okay, so we're in Ireland now. Like, day two or three? I don't remember at this point. It's technically, like, day two. Because we got in late Monday night to Ireland. Look at that view. But anyways, we're in Hoth right now. Which is spelled like Hoth, but with a W. H-O-W-T-H. And it is really pretty. See the backdrop right there. Man. Because Dublin kind of sucks. But Hoth is awesome. Because we got to Ireland and we're like, okay, this place sucks compared to Copenhagen when we got to Dublin. Uh, but Hoth has been really cool. We uh, The only really good parts so far was went to a cool comic shop where I got some issues because uh, they actually had single issues on like the comic shop in Copenhagen, which did not. I'll see if I can like get some footage inside the... Um, comic shop because I'm definitely going back there and I might visit some other comic shop because there's a bunch in Dublin. Um, I don't know how well you can see me with all the sun and stuff. Anyways, we saw the uh, Jedi Archives which in episode 2, you remember when Obi-Wan went there and wanted to like, find out more stuff about Master Sife Adias? In episode 2, that's, uh, we went there. Like when we got there, uh, I said to my sister, I was like, this is the Jedi Archives! And she's like, yeah, it looks just like it. And then we went in there, they had a comic book open and a thing, like information card next to it saying, does this look familiar to you? And it was a Star Wars comic book and it says, this is what inspired the Jedi Archives in episode two. And I was like, oh, that's so cool. And so, yeah, it turns out uh, we went to the actual Jedi Archives. Of course, the whole Jedi Archives were like CGI in the movie, but we went to what inspired them. So that was cool, but um, yeah, today's Wednesday, new comic book day. <laughs> but uh, I w yeah, that's basically all we've done so far. And then tomorrow and Friday, my sister's got a conference, so I'm going to be lone wolfing it, probably going to comic shops, maybe go, oh yeah, we just saw Man from Uncle, which is amazing. I don't know why it's been getting such like mediocre reviews, but uh, Man from Uncle is great. It's my favorite movie of the year so far with Fury Road as a close second. But Man from Uncle was great. I, of course, I'm a big Guy Ritchie fan. He's one of my favorite directors. And uh, Henry Cavill killed it, stole every scene he was in. But yeah, I love Man From U.N.C.L.E. The story wasn't as smart as, say, like the Sherlock Holmes movies, which had like some really clever storytelling, but the characters and everything were great in it. Anyways, that's it for Hoth right now. May vlog later and Hoth once we get to like a really cool looking place. But right now, that's our view. It looks so cool. But yeah, that's Hoth. Okay, so we are currently hanging out over some cliff in Hoth. It's awesome. It's so cool we're not even on the top yet. Hello. Hello. This is so cool. It's so green. It's so different than like Dublin, like we're inside the city. Like we're just sitting here and we're trying to make it to the um to the top of the cl of the cliff up there. See if you can see it. No, you can't really see it from here. I'm terrible with the camera right now. But yeah, this is where we're at right now. And over there, let's see if I can zoom in on it. There's a diving board. You can see it right there. Just a random diving board on the cliff that someone just decided to put there for some reason. But yeah, well, we're trying to make it to the top of that cliff. Hopefully we make it up there soon. We shall see. In the meantime, we've got this awesome view.
So we are now at like the top. Well, actually we're past the top, the tip top where we wanted to go. And now we're over here and like, it's just so cool. Uh, it, this, is, this is awesome. We climbed the top, ate some blackberries, which is amazing. And over there, it's like a far cry tower. Did to go take it down for pagan men or vase? I don't know. Anyways, a little distracted. This place is so cool. We've been here basically all day. Well, since like we got out of man from uncle, which was like five o'clock. We came here, ate, and then climbed up to where we're currently at. And it's amazing. Like we were thinking about turning back when we got to the like the point of the mountain. And they're like, no, let's let's go to let's go higher. And then we found like there's this whole village up here. And it's so cool. And there's a bunch of horses and like donkeys and stuff. And just flowers and beautifulness everywhere. <laughs> Everything just looks so cool. But yeah, this is definitely the best part of Ireland because the city of Dublin is pretty terrible. It's like nothing special. But here in Howth is awesome. And like just climbing up here is amazing. It's so cool. It's like being able to venture around here is awesome. It's just, yeah, it's cool. But anyways, that's basically just my update of saying how cool this part of Ireland is. So yeah, see how much further we go because it's like 8.30 right now, so it's about to get dark, but yeah.